What's up friends, Full of Car Collectors, Card Obvious here. Today we are back with another Mail Day Monday for you. Uh, today we got four things in the mail. Uh, we got Jeff Airtime, we got a trade on Beckett, uh, we got a contest winning from TCC, and a trade with Big Harv. So before we break into those, let's go ahead and add to the giveaway stash. Uh, some of these cards, sorry for the harsh lighting coming through my window, it's pretty bright outside. Um, some of these cards I got in that Fairfield Prime Pack I opened on Friday. So those will go into the giveaway stash. Remember, to be eligible for the giveaway stash, all you gotta do is comment on any of my videos in October, any of my uploads, I should say, because I don't add in live streams to the uh, to the wheel or to the randomizer. So any of my uploads in October, comment, you have a chance to win that giveaway stash. So without further ado, let's break into this. First off, Jeff Airtime. This is a trivia win. I'm pretty sure there's only uh, probably one card in here. Uh, actually yesterday I did pretty well on the trivia. I won three times, which is pretty good. But I think on this one, I only managed to win one card, and I do not remember what I picked. So let's see what we got here. As always, uh, Jeff leaves a note. Thanks for participating in Sunday Morning Trivia, Jeff Airtime. And see what we got in here. Oh, we got Rod Carew, as always. And, of course, Jeff Airtime is awesome and threw in a few extra cards, which I will add to the giveaway stash, which is awesome. Thank you, Jeff Airtime, for adding in the extra cards. And then this card saver here. So, yeah, I'm pretty sure this Rod Carew, I believe that's, what, 78 Rod Carew? Yeah, 78 Rod Carew is the card that I won in the trivia. And um, it also came with this 80, was it 85? 85 Rod Carew. There we go. And he threw in an extra 75 card here of John Doherty. This card right here is going to be going to the giveaway stash for one of you lucky winners. Always good to get vintage. Always good to get vintage. All right. Let's set these to the side. We'll get into the next package here. Uh, this was a Beckett trade. Uh, this envelope got a little beat up you can see it's like got a little little opening here so hopefully the cards in here are the same are good to go uh, looks okay got some top loaders taped unfortunately they didn't use um, painters tape they used packing tape which is unfortunate because usually it's pretty hard to get off the packing tape. Yeah, I'm gonna have to cut through this. Painter's tape, folks. Always good to use painter's tape. Okay. And the reason being, is packing tape is very, very sticky. And it leaves a mess like that. Alrighty, let's see what we got in this trade here. Got Dot and Sutton here on the front. So, got quite a few cards in this trade. Uh, let's turn my autofocus off so it doesn't blur out like that. Okay, I'll try to cover up this uh, glare I'm getting off my desk here. We got this Don Sutton. What is this, 82? 82. Uh, we got this, who's that? Uh, early win? Yes, it is early win. Uh, this is 1979 TCMA early win. It's a pretty nice card. It's a little bit off center, but it's very sharp. Uh, another 78 here. We got Bob Lemon. Uh, as a manager, this is a manager card, but Bob Lemon is in the Hall of Fame as a pitcher. Here's another Hall of Famer, Tommy Lasorda, 78. We got this 71 Earl Weaver. Super excited about Heritage next year because... Um, it's going to be the 71 design, so that's pretty cool. We got this Honus Wagner All-Century Team, uh, 2000 All-Century Team, three of diamonds, Honus Wagner. That's a pretty cool little playing card there, huh? 
uh, Warren Spawn. Also a pretty cool playing card. Maybe uh, Jeff Airtime can look into picking up a deck of these and use that for card sharks. And then we got uh, Whitey Ford here from Upper Deck. This is... I uh, can't figure out what exactly this is. Whitey Ford... I can't tell if this card's dirty at the bottom or what. Or that's like the design, all these little speckles. Um, Cooperstown Collection. Cooperstown Collection, Whitey Ford. Uh, we got one of these Ted Williams inserts, which celebrates the year yet 400. Goodwin Champions, Whitey Ford. Pretty cool. Uh, got this Swinging for the Fences, Ted Williams from the Ted Williams collection here. It's pretty cool. It's Willie Mays. Nice little card there. Got one of these Yankee Stadium Legacy cards. Uh, Whitey Ford. Uh, superstar Whitey Ford here. Um, I don't know what this is. It says 1982, so I have to look that up. But I don't, I don't know that it's a superstar set from what. Pretty cool little card there, though. And another Yankee Stadium Legacy Whitey Ford. As you can notice, these two have different pictures on them. Um, one says 1950 through 1960, and the other says 1960 through 1970. Let's move it that way so it's chronological. Pretty cool there. So that was the first part of that trade. Let's take a look at the second part of this trade. Let me see if I can fix this glare down here. I know it's very dramatic, but I need to fix it. Okay, 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 that's better. So let's look at the second stack in here. So, nice little haul here for my Hall of Fame hoard. Alright, so we got Then and Now. This is from Topps Heritage. Whitey Ford and CeCe Sabathia. We got a Yankees Classics. Whitey Ford. Looks like it's stuck to another card. Upper Deck. We got this Willie Mays. It's a pretty cool little card there. Uh, 1981 Baseball Legends, Willie Mays, that's pretty cool. Got this Pee Wee Reese reprint from, uh, it's Archives, Topps Baseball Archives. I don't know what year this is. Have to look that one up. Home Run Legends, Willie Mays. This is from Big League Chew, Big League Chew Collector's Cards, 1986. Pretty cool little card there. Got another Whitey Ford here, Legends of New York. Upper Deck. Got a 1970 Earl Weaver. This card's in pretty decent shape. And it's got little soft corners up here at the top, but it's actually a pretty nice little card there. 1970 Earl Weaver. Uh, another one of these uh, Ted Williams insert cards. Heroes of Baseball, Don Sutton, Leaf. This is from 2015. Uh, got another one of these Don Sutton minis, uh, which I actually got in my last trade, so have an extra one of those. It'll probably end up in the giveaway stash. This one's pretty cool. It's a Gypsy Queen mini foil uh, Whitey Ford. It's pretty cool. Was well, $3. <laughs> a nice foil Gypsy Queen mini card. That's pretty cool. Uh, got one of these Topps Archives 2001. Uh, Yankees Ford win series opener. Got a Billy Williams in action. This card's very, very off-centered, but it's all good because this is going into my binder. Uh, what is that? 72 Billy Williams. Another one of these Ted Williams Red Sox. This one's got a folded over, but this is from Obak. Uh, TriStar Obak, and it's got Whitey Ford here. It says U.S. Army for the Korean War. Pretty cool. Another Whitey Four. This is from the National uh, Sports Card Collector Convention 2012. Whitey Ford. Got a Diamond Legends Whitey Four. This is a Cooperstown Collection again. Upper Deck. We got this Don Sutton. What is that? 89 score? 88 score? Excuse me. Don Sutton. Another one of these Ted Williams inserts. We got this Gaudi. Uh, they call these foreign ones. This is the blue. Uh, they had blue and red, I believe, and black, I think. Uh, but this one features Whitey Ford, A-Rod, uh, Chen Ming Wang, and uh, Derek Jeter. And finally, we got this uh, Don Russ, Hall of Fame Heroes. It's stuck to another card. Another Whitey Ford here. 
uh, Donner's Hall of Fame Heroes 1983. And this Whitey Ford, I don't know what's up with his penny sleeves. Looks like somebody chewed off the top of it. And a cool little kind of die cut card, Living Legends 1986 Sports Go Series 1 card number 2. Um, the stain looks like it's on the penny sleeve, not on the card. Yes. That stain is on the penny sleeve. So cool. Cool little haul there on a Beckett trade. So thanks to that trader on Beckett for helping to add to my Hall of Fame hoard. My binders are filling up. I had to get some more binders because my binders are starting to get too full. So this is from TCC. This is a... Um, TCC stopped doing the weekly prizes, but it's still giving away prizes. If you're not subscribed to TCC Baseball, definitely go check them out. Very generous person, always giving away stuff. Um, pretty much just changed up the format of his giveaways, but is still giving stuff away. So definitely check out TCC Baseball's videos. All right, so I won a team prize pack. That's interesting. I managed to cut through the envelope, but not the uh, bubble lining on it. There we go. Come on now. So it looks like we might got a note in there. Got some cardboard in here. Help protect it. We got some more stuff in here too. Another little pack here. I think we're empty. Nope, we're empty. Awesome sauce. So this says, thanks for waiting and being a great subscriber, Mike. TCC, the collector's corner. Awesome. Thank you, Mike, for that little note. And I told him I was a Braves fan. So, of course, he sent me a bunch of Braves. Let's see what we got in here. All right, we got Kent Merger. Kent Merger, part of one of the, I think he was the last person to throw a no hitter in Braves history. Kent Merger, Greg Olson, Ozzy Virgil, we got Bob Horner, Hector Oliveira. He didn't really work out as a Brave or anything. Uh, ooh, Gaylord Perry, very nice. 82 Gaylord Perry, Hall of Famer. Gary Renicky. Here's a Dave Justice from Collector's Choice. Um. Special edition David Justice is pretty cool. This is a 95 card. 87 Donruss Rick Mahler, Ozzy Virgil, a Tommy Glavin, 89. Very nice. Another Ozzy Virgil. Derek Lilliquist, Zane Smith, Bob Horner again. Bruce Sutter, another Hall of Famer, very nice. Ted Simmons, Claudel Washington, Paul Runge, David Palmer, Pete Smith, Dale Murphy. Ted Simmons, now we got Nick Markakis, Tyler Flowers, Mr. Freddie Freeman, oops, that was Julio Tehran and Dion James, Julio Tehran, pretty cool, and we'll go through the second stack here, gotta love when you get a fan pack like this, it's fully your favorite team, Mr. Lonnie Smith, shout out to Back in the Game Collecting. Uh, Braves leaders Glenn Hubbard and I don't recognize who that is right there um, This was really before I became a baseball fan this 87 um, I don't recognize that player right there number 16. But I know the other one is Glenn Hubbard Maybe Rafael Ramirez if I had to guess Pretty cool Mr. Russ Nixon of course nobody remembers him because Bobby Cox is the only manager uh, that people remember he took over after Russ Nixon left Joe Bover Zane Smith Albert Hall Kevin Kaufman Bruce Benedict Jim Acker uh, Braves leader card here um, This one's <laughs> this one's got a little crease in it. It's all good. It's 89 tops um, Trying to figure out who this is it looks like Mark Lemke and I don't know who the other guy is. Mark Lemke, definitely. Probably Gerald Perry, if I had to guess. It's definitely not Ron Gant. So I'm guessing that's Gerald Perry. I know that's Mark Lemke. First person ever signed a baseball card for me. Rock Mark Lemke, Bruce Suter, Charlie Puleo, 
there he is ron gant it's my boy right there ron gant cup card ron gant of course had a 30 30 season uh in 80 was he 90 and 91 had two back-to-back 30 30 seasons so this uh, i don't think this is his rookie card but it might be his rookie card ron gant one of my favorite players from back then paul Ossenmacher. uh also blanco evan gaddis rookie card brian hunter another bruce Suter. Deion James, Ozzy Virgil, Jeff Treadway, uh, rest in peace, Tommy Hansen, and Mike Fulton Evich. Notice they kind of have a similar look there. Tommy Hansen was a pretty talented young hurler. Uh, unfortunately, passed away due to substance abuse. Uh, Fulty, Fulty just pitched the gym in the second game of the NLDS this week. Jose Alvarez and Joe Bever. So I appreciate that, TCC. That was awesome. Thank you for all these Braves cards. Definitely check out TCC Baseball. And last but not least, we have Big Harv. Uh, Big Harv and me worked out a trade. Big Harv wanted uh, some A's cards that I had up for sale on Cronosio. And said, yeah, sure, I'd do a trade for him. So I said, I'll send them to you, no problem. Just uh, send back whatever you feel is fair. So we'll see what Big Harv sends back. Awesome, Big Harv. I got an autographed Big Harv card. That is sweet. Love it already. Love it already. Look at that. 87 Tops Design, Future Star, Big Harv, Autographed, very nice, you make me smile, that's right Big Harv, you make me smile, that is a great card, I appreciate it Big Harv, sweet autograph card there, of YouTuber Big Harv, very nice buddy, I really appreciate that, ooh, we got a Hunter Renfro, wow, Origins, Patch Auto, holy crap. Hunter Renfro, Patch Auto, out of 75. Wow, dude. Big Harv, come on, man. What I sent you is nothing even close to this. Nothing even close to this. <laughs> you gotta be kidding me, man. Wow, dude. That's, that's wild. Hunter Renfro, RPA. That is, that's crazy. <laughs> I don't even know what to say, man. Those cards I sent, man, this just, this just blows it out of the water. I mean, that was enough for what I sent you. Just your autograph, man. This is, oh, man. That is sick, dude. Thank you. Hunter Renfro. RPA out of 75 out of Origins. That is amazing, dude. Thank you, thank you, thank you. It doesn't want to stand up there. I'll lay right there. And we got a Ken Griffey Jr. 91 upper deck. Very sweet. Thank you for that. And another Ken Griffey Jr. Sweet. This is from Archives. I think this year's Archives. Uh, 2019. Yes, definitely. 2019 Archives. We got a Mr. Devante Parker from Absolute Memorabilia. That is awesome. We got a Nolan Ryan here. Pretty cool. What is this card from? Mother's Cookies. Mother's Cookies. Nolan Ryan. Talks about his fourth no-hitter in 1975. That's cool, man. I like that card. Tom Seaver. 82 tops. Very nice. Very nice, Tom Seaver. Thank you, sir. We got a 89 score. Wade Boggs. Sweet. It's 89 tops. Wade Boggs. Very nice. 91 tops. Ryan Sandberg. Love my Hall of Famers. Another 91 tops. Alan Trammell. And Ozzie Smith. We got 88. Edgar Martinez. That's a rookie, isn't it? Isn't that an Edgar Martinez rookie? That's awesome. We got a Jim Tomei. 92 rookie prospect card. Very nice. Very nice Jim Tomei rookie. 92 score. We got a Goose and Nolan Ryan. Another not Nolan Ryan from 92 Donruss. 
Another Nolan Ryan. This is 90 tops. Nolan Ryan. Phil Negro. Can you believe he was still pitching in 1990? But yes, he was. Phil Negro. Eddie Murray from 89 Donruss. Greg Maddox, member's choice. Nice. Stadium Club. Very sweet. It's 93 Stadium Club. Greg Maddox. Another Greg Maddox here. This is Upper Deck from 94. Very nice. 94 Upper Deck Greg Maddox. And yes, Ben Wells, if you happen to be watching this video, that is the correct uniform. Uh, Stadium Club, this is 91, I think. Uh, 93. 93 Stadium Club. Another Greg Maddox. Mr. Gary Carter. Gary Carter, 89 tops. Very sweet. Eddie Stanky. This is from Diamond Kings. Mickey Mantle. Tony Gwynn. Honus Wagner. Uh, Shoeless Joe Jackson. Vlad Guerrero. And Chipper Jones flashback card. Very nice. 2019 Diamond Kings. Wow, Big R. If you went above and beyond what I sent you. Above and beyond, my man. That is sick, dude. I can't believe that. Like, seriously, this card right here, I, I, I wasn't expecting this <laughs> at all. Um, I think I recognize this card from Deafness' stream, uh, from the 24-hour stream, and I can't believe you, you actually sent this card over to me. That's, that is wild, dude. I don't even know how to thank you. Um, like I said, this was a trade, and... You blew your end of the trade out of the water compared to what I sent you. Um, doesn't even compare to this. This is amazing. Uh, thank you again, Big Harv. If you are not subscribed to Big Harv, definitely head over and check out Big Harv. I'll have his uh, TCC Baseball and Jeff Airtime's channel in the description below. Um, thank you all once again for watching. I really appreciate it. Appreciate all the support I'm getting. I will be going live this Wednesday evening at 8 p.m to do the uh bargain uh buster box break um group break i forgot what i even named it it's got a lot of bees in it <laughs> but yeah so the the baseball budget break i'm doing with the random packs will be wednesday at 8 p.m i want to thank everybody that bought into that and i want to thank all of you that are watching my videos wouldn't do it without you i wouldn't even be in this hobby without you so once again thank you this is the card hobbyist i'll catch y'all later